Good morning. It is literally 24 hours to the dot before we leave for our trip to San Diego. And guess what guys? We haven't packed one bit. Like the suitcases are right here. Oh, it's just been so much going on with selling our home, buying a new home. This trip is coming at a time where it'll be nice to relax, but we just are juggling quite a bit. So I'm definitely feeling like we are not as prepared as we have been on other trips. Like it's just been like hiccup after hiccup. We can't travel without Cali supplies and they're due to land or they're due to arrive at our home tomorrow, but we'll leave tomorrow. So that's not gonna work. So we've had a call our supply team. We've had a call food supplies and and get some rush orders and so like are we gonna get everything in time we shall see but we can only do what we can control and we're gonna have a good time so let's get this this trip going let's get packed and let's get out of here daddy is up from working, the night shift, y'all. She was sleeping good, but she would just get like, uh, I couldn't get it out. Like I did a neb and everything, I did drops and everything. Finally, I just stayed up at four. So I, I was up <sighs> since four, basically. On top of everything, we lost our Friday night nurse. So her last shift was last week. So this is the first open Friday we have. So yeah, Rome worked last night. He was up with Callie and then oh, we oh leave tomorrow. God at <laughs> we gotta give it 4 a.m so i'm taking the lead on the packing rose and get some rest i got this is my trick when you want to pack and not have it messed up put the kids on the ipad y'all and they won't get into everything look at them they over here dancing Always time for a dancing break, y'all. <laughs> Good morning. It is 5 a.m. We have a half hour. Doing our last finishing touches. We got Callie up, Gigi's here. Gonna go get Roman up and start getting ready and break down Callie's room. This is like the most important part of the day of the trip is getting all of her equipment packed in our carry-ons. Alaska Airlines has been amazing, as you guys remember from Cabo. So we had to run it back, okay? Because like there's no other airline that takes care of you like they do. So we got our packing list. They know all the carry-ons we're bringing and amazing to work with. So that also just takes away some of the stress of the morning. Hi, boo. I know. This right here is our packing list. Every single suitcase is outlined with items in this list, okay? So we don't leave anything behind. And it's so important that we have all of her equipment so she can thrive while on vacation. From the compressor to oxygen, like we even need emergency items, okay? We can't leave anything behind. We provide this list to Alaska Airlines and they set us up nicely. Hey, oh, I did the one under the black. <laughs> I know. Right. Yeah, you didn't go on airplane. <laughs> 5.58, we need to get in the car in like the next five, 10 minutes. Security is always the hardest part, but we got through it so smooth at SeaTac and it gave us enough time to go by Alaska Airlines Lounge, the new one, and see everything, okay? We got amazing accommodations from the front desk. They found a spot for us that fit everything we have from suitcases to nurses. The kids were loving just looking out the big windows and looking at the planes. We loved getting some food and just sitting down for a minute before we had to get to our gate. But look at this. The nurses were eating good. It was great, y'all. And then we got to our gate and what was amazing is that Alaska Airlines allowed us to board last, but still saved overhead space for us. Yeah. Here we go. I'm sorry. It's okay. Say it again on the airplane. <laughs> you doing a setup? Romy, you're being good. Oh my God. Everything. 
awesome. And then we could put a backpack there yeah. if we need to. Say hi. Oh, nice. Take a bite. What? Whew, it was a lot of work, but we got the best crew that helped us get on this flight, y'all. And I like that we going last, and they saved all the overhead space for us. Did they? Come on, Alaska, with the custom crew. One. So like there's no under the seat space, so like the suction machine get to figure out what to do with it because policy is it can't be loose. They were like, we already know about that. That's cool. That's fine. Keep it with you. We're good. We already know. We did our research. Nice. You eating? Feed this hungry boy. Mm. <laughs> Hi, sweetie. <laughs> I wish you could go to sleep and then look at me too. I know, it's like so upright. First class was amazing, but we were all just so excited to get to our destination, which was San Diego. So Alaska Airlines has new routes and more flights to West Coast locations. So San Diego, if you haven't been, check it out. There's so many things for the whole family. And there's just a lot of flights leaving out of Seattle and other locations. So make sure you go check that out and let me know how much you enjoyed not just san diego but all the other new west coast locations that you can fly on look at our girl she was loving it y'all she flying first class just blessed got her little fidgety toy that's what you have to do is stock up on toys for the kids roman really just ate everyone's food he just loves food but how can you not when you got the kids snack you got i got me like a breakfast sandwich and they went to let the kids play a little bit together that is nurse jane Callie always has to have a one-to-one -on -one caregiver with her. So Nurse Jane got to be with Callie. Roman's a lap baby. He was pretty occupied. And I got a little break to enjoy. Ooh, the clouds. And then also the views when we landed in San Diego, y'all. But of course, little man had to take a little nap on me. But again, let me know if you've been to San Diego because this is our second time and I can't wait for you guys to see all the things we do here because we are gonna make this a staple every summer, San Diego. It's a vibe. Wow, this house is huge. It's got oh. six rooms. Oh my goodness. The dog. Woo! Woo! Master, baby. You ready, 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 ready? Can we go swimming? What's out there? Oh yeah, dance. Let me see, Rumi. Pool. <laughs> Pool. <laughs> Okay, we'll put sister here. Unpacking all of Callie's equipment and suitcase is always the first thing we do before we get settled. And as you see, it's all hands on deck. It has been a really long day. Actually, it's been a really long, like, last three days. I'm glad we're here, but man, morning flights are tough. Cause like, you just feel it all day long. So I'm glad that we're here. It's a vibe. Like, I've been showing you the best part of the house, which is this pool. This is where we're gonna be. Like, look at this. We're gonna be chilling here. 
the kids are going to be sitting there because it's low right there. We got the floaties right here. Okay. We got the hot tub over here. Uh, maybe Rome will grill. Like we can just chill here. And we got the turf over here. And we can do some games right here with the cornhole. Like how amazing is this space? And it's got six bedrooms. So yes, we took every, not every single, but we took three nurses. So we could like enjoy ourselves. And like, we're very blessed to be able to bring them on our trips because we do have to cover accommodations and flight, but it allows us to still have a vacation. Being able to have Alaska Airlines help us get out here, make the travel something that isn't something that like, make it a deterrence. Like it doesn't make it a negative because sometimes when you think about how much work goes into packing, getting on the flight, like we literally had eight carry-ons for Cali alone. They customized our flight attendants. They saved overhead space in first class just for us. They got us first class tickets. Like the list goes on and on, like why we'll always fly Alaska Airlines, but also how they've made life possible, travel possible. Callie is never gonna grow up feeling like her syndrome, her medical needs have been something that have delayed and stopped her from living life, that she's missed opportunities because of it. No, she gonna know that she's so blessed and that despite all, her parents, with help from airlines like Alaska Airlines to nursing staff, made it possible for her so i can't wait for girl I'm, I'm, am i talking to you right now i can't wait for you to watch this video back and see how blessed you are with the pool behind me though 